Hi, this is Andrew and Logan, and today we're going to show you how to get Backgrounder and Karaka. These are two things where you can run other apps in the background while you are doing it. So first, you'll open up Rock or Studio. This is especially useful for when you're downloading something from either Installus or Safari. Or Rock, because... That'll take a long time, but you can do run that in the background and play your games or whatever in the foreground. Okay, so you can, first you'll probably go to search, and you'll get backgrounder. Backgrounder. No backgrounder. Mhm. Mm so you need you need to download both of these different things. This yeah. is the first you need to download. See right here, it should have like a little fold on it, rated four stars. Somewhere around there. So you'll just install it like normal. You don't need to exit out or anything. Yep, just install that. It should take a while. It might it might require a software start, but yeah. but you can just say on exit. Yep, on exit because you also need to download this other thing. It's Kay. called Karakot. Karakot. So this is how you spell it. K I R I K A E. A E. That's how you spell this. We'll have that in the video description. Yep. Along with backgrounder. Just so you're sure how to spell it. So this is up only one. To be rated five stars. Yep. That's what you want to download also. This is the thing that is this is a, like a better thing to do yeah. than background because it's a little more reliable. And it's So if you need a software start, just install and stuff. Yep. And then and, and then when it says software start, then you can say okay. Because then I'll stop for start for this and so it should look like this is a little swapper thing and this was mm-hmm. Thing in the so, once you open up Backgrounder, it should look somewhat like this. It'll have three different things. Um, you, the bottom one doesn't really make doesn't, you don't really need to do this. So this is the one you can always enable an app if you go on it every single time. But really, if you have it always enabled, you have to remember before you make it sleep before, like if you keep yours on sleep mode all night long, then make sure you. Then make sure you um, stop it, so you make sure it's not going in the background, because otherwise it runs down your battery really, really fast. That's a problem I had. So you don't really need to go to global, but for control, you can have it on a home button. So you hold it down until it appears, because yeah. you can set um, another thing on the other one that you can make it do the exact same thing. It really doesn't that big of a deal. Ba backgrounder is just a basic thing, so you can say... Yeah. You can put your badge on just to make you so you know which ones. Okay, so once you're done with that, you'll open up Kiraka, or however you say that's some Japanese name, and you don't need documentation or anything. See, nothing in there. But favorites, you'll need favorites. Yes, these are the ones that when you open it up like this, and it has two tabs on it, favorites. These are the ones you can easily access very easily by clicking on it, and it'll automatically open up the app. So you can choose whatever one you want. Yeah, so I'm just going to choose, yeah, see, all these in here. So you can, that doesn't really matter, but control, you want to do the third one down, home button, press and hold, just the same as background. Yep, same, same as background, so it does both at once. And appearance, that doesn't matter too much. Yeah, you can. But just make sure they're all on. In general, yeah, you can do the same things that we did right here. Yeah. You want to have access tab on, favorites tab on. You don't really need the other two on, and then you can always yeah. start with definitely active tab, and that's really all you have to do there. Yeah. So then, what this actually does, I'll show you how this works. So you will go to any app. We'll just go to install since this is one that you actually might be doing it on, and we'll have we can show you how this all works in another video. So while we load up install us. So let's pretend we're downloading something. What you want to do is you want to hold down the home button. And I'll say background enabled or disabled. It doesn't really matter what that says. And then do you see how it says foreground application? This is the application that you're looking at. The background applications is what usually has mail down here, but I just X that out. And the home screen springboard. So if you say you want to open up another app, you can just click on springboard. It take this is your springboard. And you can, let's say you want to play a game, I want to play Cartoon Wars. So then I can do this. And then what you can do, you can go back to your home button. See, it'll say enabled or disabled. You can go to install us. 
and then you can just see where how far you're downloading so that's how you work and